Hi there, it's Stuart Fensterheim. Good morning. I have a dog in my office, Ollie. Ollie is not a run-of-the-mill therapy dog because a regular emotionally therapy dog is a dog that just comes in and plays and it's nice to pet. But there's another classification that Ollie is, which is an animal-assisted therapy dog. He's actually part of the counseling. He's actually the best part of the counseling at times. My wife says there's more people coming to see me because of Ollie than to see me because of my skill as a couples counselor. Animal-assisted therapy dogs have been around for many years. What makes them unique is that they encompass all different kinds of theoretical model, but more importantly, they are part of the treatment plan. That means when I develop a treatment plan on a couple that is about let's say conflict resolution or communication skill. Ollie is an integral part of that. Let me give you an example. I had a couple in my office a while back. One of the things that was happening is their voices were getting raised and Ollie, who was there for this purpose, sensed that. And rather quickly, what he did is he ran to the door. I said, okay guys, let's take a look at Ollie. Ollie, reacted to the intensity in the room. And the four of us had a conversation about what impact Ollie and more importantly, their children or the people in their environment at home have when their conflicts become somewhat scary and they get very loud and it is sort of scary. So what does that tell us about a service animal? or a therapy dog, an animal-assisted therapy dog. Ollie is the most loving dog that you could ever come across. If you have an interest in having me work with you, you as a couple or as, as an individual using a service animal-assisted therapy dog, give me a call. I offer a free, no-obligation consult that can help us find out if we're a good fit and if Ollie is going to be a good ad advantage to you as a couple or as an individual in working on your relationship issues.